So guys, right, what a position this is, and uh, the feedback has been overwhelming. The closer you get to this position, I'm going to show you, the better that you're going to hit the golf ball. And we're looking at just better compression, much better contact, better penetrating flight, and really just to you know improve your all-round ball striking. We're going to be looking at some amateur players here. We're going to be looking at... Uh, the correct geometry in your through swing. This position is really not looked at enough. Is it's always down swing, it's always the slot, it's always looking at impact. But you get this part right, and it has a wonderful chain reaction on the rest of your motion. And we're just seeing just every single player in this position. So we're gonna take you through some amazing clips. We're gonna have a look at some of the amateur players as well here. And we're gonna talk about how to get ourselves into this position. If you're looking at all these top players, and they're all just about exactly the same, and you're not in this position, doesn't it make sense to look at it, guys? This is going to have a great effect on your on your ball striking. Uh, let's get stuck into it. So, guys, isn't it fascinating when we're looking at really, really solid ball strikers? Even you know someone in your local club or you know, world class players or top amateur players, and you look at uh, one of the major checkpoints in the golf swing, and we we get in there and go, "Wow, that's unbelievable! How similar these top players are." But it's not looked at enough, right? So when you look at you know at the averages of movement, the top players. You say, okay, surely we need a bit of a plan, a bit of a goal, a bit of a something to work towards. You know, it's not all feel. That's why people, who's not feeling their swings these days with mobile phones? Right? If you're serious about your golf and investing in your golf, who's not filming their swings? It's just nobody, right? So when you're looking at these, you know, these top players, just you know, moving through impact with four to six inches or 10 to 15 centimeters lateral movement, but they're able to create, which gives us great compression and low point control. But they're also able to separate their top half from their bottom half. And this is why I've drawn this line down, you know, the back here, from the back of the shoulder down through the ribs. Because these great players, you know, even past and present, when we look at Hogan, we're seeing them in this position. And, it, you know, you have to work towards getting in this position and getting your body moving forwards, but getting the arching of the back and the ribs here, creating the separation. This area has a chain reaction on the swing that will tend to help us hit it more from the inside. When we're seeing club golfers, unfortunately, you know, we'll see them not being able to get that separation through the ball. And sometimes they're close and closer, and then sometimes they're quite a long way away where they're starting to spin the left hip and, you know, not getting the body to work effectively. Through certain drills, we get closer, and depending on your talent level, you know, it, and it takes time. There's no, there's so much point in jumping from video to video, hoping that there's a, a magic wand in some YouTube video. When you look at facts, right? When you look at the instruction that works with evidence-based material, that makes sense. You know, worldclassgolf.com with Dr. Rob Neal and I, so that you can, you know, work with a plan so that you can chip away at your golf and, and work forwards and improve. That's how you get good at something. That's how you really develop a great swing. And looking at these movements through the ball from different positions and different angles, we can get in there and say, okay, this is actually what's happening with the swing. Right, this is how I'm going to improve. I'm going to get my, I'm going to get the shoulder to lift up. I'm going to get my hips to move forwards. And then through the ball, I've got a couple of checkpoints here. I've got my app, you know, I'm going to film my swing. I say, all right, every single player is in this position and I'm not, how do I fix it? And are you gonna do it in an hour? Probably not. But, you know, better off hitting on the right path now than instead of, you know, going around in circles and not seeing, you know, any improvement. Let's have a look at some amazing positions from down the line before we get into some drills and some exercises. If you're new to the, to the channel, guys, uh, hit subscribe and then hit that bell or that button where it's got all plenty of videos coming your way. Let's get further into the video. So guys, right down the line, same position. Really, really interesting looking at how close great ball strikers are. How close are you? Now this is gonna give you a great gauge. We'll look at some club players, some amateur players as well here. Let's draw this line down using this, uh, the world's best software analyzing system from V1 Golf, the V1 Pro system, 55 degrees. Let's have a look at Sam Snead here as we draw the line down and get a gauge of that 55 degrees. That's absolutely remarkable. We're gonna have a look at uh, a couple of other players. Now this system is on V1 Golf, just quickly for on um, no, this, this V1 Pro system on worldclassgolf.com for $99, around 500 for a year. And it just has so many different tools and things. It's what all the top coaches are using, so check that one out. All right, let's have a look here at uh, another tool player. 
We'll take a peek at Rory He. Have a look at this golf swing first, guys. I want to play this through to you. Just check this out because this is a golf swing. This guy's a, a winner on the Asian tour. Have a look. This is filmed with a mobile phone. Have a look how good this golf swing is, will you? You should see this guy hit it. Really, really, what a pure iron player this guy is. One of the best I've seen. Now through the ball, arms parallel, what are we seeing? We get up a bit further, about there I say arms are parallel, and we draw a line down, we see like we got 54 degrees. So we've got really similar. Now what are the, where are the club players? You know, sometimes they're moving through the ball, they're not too far away. There's a laying the face a little bit open. That's the position people that we've really been drilling into people on World Class Golf and on the YouTube uh, channel here to, you know, get in here. And once you get this club coming in slightly behind the hands and it's on this side here, you know, rather than the club players, this is why they're flipping it. You know, they're getting this sort of position over here. But let's just have a quick look here at uh, the shoulder plane moving through the ball. And we'll see, you know, this is what we're seeing a lot. We're not seeing any the left side extension's not really there and other things that are happening. 36 degrees. We're seeing this a lot with, you know, different players. Then see the shaft coming in too steep. And then not have any room for the arms here. We can see also around 35 degrees or even close to 36. Very similar numbers, isn't it? And, the, and the, you know, the hips being very, very level. So this is the issue that people are, are having and they're not checking. Now there's different drills and there's different exercises and there's different ways to go about fixing it up. You know, we really like to get this right knee to get to the golf ball, to get the knees moving and uh, to get some arching in the back. We have a separation series and, and different drills on obviously on world-class golf, but you can see that the knee getting to the finish line before the hands do, and then we can get this extension up with the shoulder. And this really, just by getting this curve of the back, you'll get your extension. World-class golf instruction has over 700 detailed videos for every golfer. Practice programs and evidence-based material is applied to helping you to become your own coach and play your best golf. And join us in the chat room and join the community of world-class golf instruction. Right, we want to be thinking about every single thing in the golf swing, but we need to have structure. It's a difficult game to feel. Here's a good one if you've got the chance to hit up some grass or pop something about a fist width in front of your left hip. And we're going to be moving, not twisting and having that right knee come out and the left hip go back. We're going to be really bringing this lead hip forward. Now I exaggerated this a little bit. You can see that the hips really moving into the shaft and then we're getting this arching of the back here through the golf ball, closing up the gap with your knees. All right, really important to get this, closing this gap up and this is going to get this arch is going to get the extension that you're after. Guys, yes, this is an important part of the golf swing and chipping away at your golf. We've got so many different drills and things in world-class golf instruction where we're really looking at getting the shoulders to work on a better plane and lifting the shoulders steeper on the way through as they went on the way back. And uh, this is the best way to get, you know, the most out of your golf. As I said, guys, online lessons, have a look at craighansongolf.com. And uh, if, you, if you like the video, like the video, that helps me out. Just trying to really, we're reaching you know lots, many more people, and the feedback that we're getting also from the deep to shallow swing style there on World Class Golf, it's just been fantastic, guys. I hope you enjoyed the video. Um, give it a thumbs up for me, and uh, yep, we'll catch you next time. See you then.